Okay, we're back. Let's finish out the dungeon. Um, maybe we'll gain another level. Well, we will gain another level. Um, and what I'm saying is maybe I'll have some more MR. Because I would like to have, like, one more pip. Hmm. Not so sure about fighting this thing. We don't have our elect. I'm sure it'll be fine with... Yeah, there we go. Drain life. Or, um, well, not drain life. Vampiric touch. You know what I mean. Not the same thing, though, though. There actually is something in the game called Drain Life. It's the, the uh, Urad ability. I still need things out of both these books. Control Undead's really good. Hmm. Let's just drop the stones. We don't need stones anymore. Cool, scroll of identify. Ring of wizardry. Um, we're doing just fine on casting. We don't need to we don't need to cast anything sooner. Well, this staff is really I mean I guess a plus ten Vorpal staff is not gonna be anything to scoff at, but it's still kind of impressive. Dude, keeping in mind that we cannot, um, we cannot vampire touch him, so we may have to blink away. We're okay. There's a hydra. Hmm. A couple scrolls of immolation we could use with a skeleton. Seven heads. You know what? Let's uh, let's just reset the fight. As much as I could, make a bunch of orc skeletons and emulate if I felt like it. No reason, no reason to worry about that just yet. Okay. Um, I still haven't added this to my RC. Why don't we just do that real fast? Okay, add an RC. Uh, let's see, how do I do this? I want to add... Something hits you. That should be enough. Um, I've noticed my force more doesn't quite work right. Um, there might be some kind of bug in here. Some kind of typo. But this should be fine. Let's test it now. Yeah, okay, it's force mooring and it's flashing. This is a little annoying, but it's it'll keep me from historically I have pressed O a bunch and I'll get I'll get hit by those things like multiple times, which could be really bad on a caster character or a character that's injured. Okay, um as for this stuff. Well, that didn't work. Whoops. I should have closed that door. Okay, he's confused. Um... This should be fine. Seven heads is 140 damage, or thereabouts. Um, well, 120 as well. 
not it's more hit points than we have and I don't want to do the math on whether GDR will save me so we're just gonna make some corpses looks like we've got a Hydra hmm that didn't quite work you know what Ah oh, man, I don't want to waste immolation just on a single Hydra. This is silly. I'll just make some more dudes here. Unfortunately, these these kind of suck at this point in the game. Miasma doesn't work too well against a Hydra. It's our poise. We just need, like, just a little more... The Hydra should have done it. Uh, the Hydra Skeleton, I mean. <sighs> well, we have a scroll of recharging. Two-headed ogre. He can do about 75 damage. 35 plus 40. So, yeah, 75. If only we had Haunt online, that would be really nice. To the point where I almost want to start training summoning. Although, Ice is probably the better call because I'll have that online sooner. There we go. Hmm. Here we go. Nice. Finally. Just had to get a Hydra or a, or a Cyclops, something that did good damage. See, we've leveled up. At, we were leveled up once since we started this uh, video, so let's just check. I want to see if. Okay, we didn't gain any MR, unfortunately, from leveling up. turn off spell casting and learn summons and we'll see how quickly this works out for us and I was thinking about something which is that Depending on what this fire resistance turn in, turns into, I believe it'll either be fiery blood or hellfire. Now, hellfire is cool. Um, fiery blood would be really awesome on this character since we're going to be exploding things via um, via infestation. Wow, MR minus, no thanks. They're really bad, but that's okay, because we have Miasma. We're going to swing, possibly taking a lot of damage, but not enough to kill us. Nice. Hmm. 
let's work backwards from all that. This is okay. I'm hoping that I get a corpse here. I do not. Whoa, okay, okay, okay. 35 plus 20 is 55. That's not enough to kill me through GDR. Uh, there was no corpse there, unfortunately. Um, I can walk away from this for now. Probably will follow. Maybe not. Okay, that worked out. I should have made that into a skeleton. He can only do 35 damage. Not a huge deal at our current hit point total. This guy is a bigger deal. Only five heads though, so I'm gonna attack. Hmm. Let's let our skeletons handle him because he can do a good amount of damage. As you can see. Wow, um. Hmm. That didn't work out. Yep, he can do... Can he kill me? 3d22, that's 66. No, he can kill me with fireball. Technically. Sucks. Um, let's let's call off healing, I suppose. Um, teleport out of here. So that's a bit of a problem. Ah, he's right next to me. Corpses. Oh boy. Um, I guess we got a blink. We're gonna drink healing. We're going to corpse rot. He slowed. That makes things a lot better. So this is a bigger threat than it looks like. We really need a ranged attack, which means we really need haunt online. Um, because these javelins just aren't going to cut it. We're not training throwing even, so. Hmm. I'm going to use box. Wow. Um, he's slow, so we can walk away. We'll use this stuff. Let's drink healing. Let's drink healing again. Make a Hydra Zombie. Make a Skeleton. A lot of damage possible here. Got him in the Miasma again. He slowed. Okay, so that was rough. Um, that was... That was a lot of resources used. Oh, hey, this guy is going to use fire on me, so let's take off our RF minus. We'll let our minions handle this dude. Come on. Come into the miasma. Nice.
and he dies. I have a great sword of flaming. That's um, that's one way to kill Hydras. Although honestly, I'd rather just hit them with the staff. The thing we're actually trained in. Okay, that's that's a wizard. Um, now we don't want to be. Um, we don't want to be killed by the wizards. Paralyze. Hmm. I just really need Haunt online. That's what's keeping me. And my low intelligence is not helping. Oh, I shouldn't have. What was that? I shouldn't have used Death Channel. It doesn't work on any of this stuff. Let's just walk away. You know, honestly, I think that the, that the, the correct move here is to just... I'm just gonna go to Orc. We'll we'll finish our dungeon here in a minute. But with the power of with with my line channel, we could just tear through this place. So I'm really just being silly by not using it and going through here. find something worth buying. Okay, we got an orc sorcerer. He can paralyze us, and he can't paralyze us with stuff in front of him, so we're going to take off the staff strictly because I could get bolted if he gets too close. We're going to let my allies take care of him, though. I'm just gonna wait next to this guy. Um, wow, my my guys are not doing their job. <laughs> They're just orcs, I guess. But uh, I guess I'll receive corpses. And yeah, I was hoping for an ogre. Oh wow, he could paralyze me now. Okay, we'll walk out. Why is the ogre not doing his work? Alright, that's it. I'm going to use brilliance. Okay, he'll die now. We got miscast. Kiku protects us. I'm seeing some flashes because of the something hits. I need to probably change that to something hits you, but this is fine. Okay, that's way better. Alright, so maybe Death Channel is not the best in here. I've changed my mind about wizardry. We're going to go pop that on, especially in here where we don't really have to worry about poison. Since I'll be swapping off a poison ring. Still not really castable with this stuff. Wow, we're really making headway on infestation a lot faster than hot, oddly enough. Okay. Get some corpses out here. Okay, turns out miscasts are not totally protected under Kiku like I thought. Hmm. 
Oh, I suppose I could just duke it out with him in melee. But really, what we need to do is we need to go buy that protection from cold. Well, let's do this on a staircase so we can pull him up. And we'll just vamp drain when we... Yeah, there we go. Ring of Ice. I guess that would be a nice spell power booster if I ever went for Simulacrum, which I eventually will. I should have trained Simulacrum, by the way. I should have trained up my ice first. I suppose I still could, but... Eh. Okay. But yeah, summoning miscasts are really bad, so we're not we're not gonna cast haunt. We're not gonna cast haunt again um, until it's not dark red, which would be a while. So why don't we just train necromancy for infestation? I suppose this character is gonna be a little awkward for a while. I guess I'll train ice as well, fine. Uh, we are getting super smited. Technically, we could get one shot at here, so I have to use a heal wounds. And I'm gonna leave. Um, you know what? I actually would like this ogre up here, or this troll, I mean to say. And the reason for that is I'm going to use it to kill the Oclob. Okay. Easy enough. Cool. have to remember that I'm not really good in melee yet. We're still basically a pure caster. Haven't trained any defenses at all, so... Well, except for fighting, if you want to count that. The only thing that keeps us alive is Vamp Drain in melee. Thankfully, we haven't really seen any more sorcerers. Sorcerers are a real pain. Uh, well... There's the starter necromancy book. Can get animate dead now. That's really all that's in there that we want other than regeneration. I suppose we could get pain. Cause fear. Um, that's a really good spell. I've kind of been turned on to the fact that cause fear is great. Recently. And Yara's in the same book. Of course, I would really like to get my high level necromancy online so this character doesn't get stalled out. 
Let's just see what else is for sale before we start buying stuff. Oh, um, he can still he can still paralyze us. However, our orc, our spectral orcs can see invisible, so that's kind of cool. I'm gonna emulate these dudes. Oh man. I just need one of them to explode. I guess I'll brilliance. Alright, there we go. That was rather wasteful, what I did there. I'm going to magic map and clear out this so I have another staircase I can go to relatively safely. You can get instantly paralyzed if you come up down here, the floor you've already been to. This is okay. We're gonna get lots of death channeled ogres, which are actually kind of decent. And we'll get some spiked club wielding corpses, hopefully. No, not quite working. will be fine as long as I can yeah, as long as I can kill him decently fast. We still are death channeling. We're gonna end up with a lot of ogres here. is okay. So if we run into another ogre mage, which we probably will, no big deal. Whoa, 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 I don't want to go up. Okay, that's all the corpses. Down he goes. So this is probably one of the tougher um, Orc 2s. Oh hey, minus Tella. That's good for Zot. Uh, we're going to want these potions. Probably don't need Might, um, but Haste and everything. Certainly good to have. We'll, we'll mark down Might as well. This ring is good. This ring is also good. We're just going to put it down on our list. Doesn't mean we're going to buy it. Faith, we don't need. Kiku actually um, has a pretty good piety um, stockpile, you know. You don't really um, find yourself burning through it quickly. Okay, we want to try out this artifact. So that's an interesting collection of items. 
Okay, we're going to let our buddies handle this problem here. Ogres coming from all sides here. actually got paralyzed too. And lightning bolt. Oh man, this is bad. Uh, I'm going to use fear. He is just doing a really, really, really good job of keeping my dudes off his back. I'm gonna go up. What a shame. Um, it's not, it's not quite cleared, but pretty much. So I'll tell you what. I'm probably gonna leave here for now. Uh, looking at this list, what I want the most is its spells, really. Why don't we drop my books here? Um, and decide what we want out of this. The most, I mean. Well, we want anime dead for sure. So we're going to start off by amnesiaing off Anime Skeleton. I'm going to look over our spell list, see if there's anything else. I could probably trade to Spell Undead for Control Undead. Um, but with that said, um, meh. I probably don't need Death Channel once I get Simulacrum online, but again, it's, it's something I'd like to keep around. So I think what we're going to do is... Let's do ice magic by itself so I can get that online faster. I'm going to memorize Animate Dead, which increases our power quite a lot. And we're going to grab this Book of Enchantments, right? And we're going to train nothing but spell casting and ice magic. We just need to get a little bit more spells uh, because I want to have Cause Fear. In fact, I probably should have gotten Cause Fear instead of. Uh, Animate dead, but this is fine. Hmm. There he is. Want him to follow me. Alright, we should be fine. We have RF plus. Maybe. Okay, there we go. Okay, this wizard is a huge deal. Um, he can banish us, and he can get the double zap. Oh, man, are you kidding me? Well, we have a ton of curing. No brilliance available. I really want to kill this wizard, so... First of all, we're going to kill that. Secondly, we're good to go on Simulacrum. And these guys will just terrorize this dude. There we go.
So now we have easily one of the most powerful spells in the game. Like a Hydra Simulacrum, a single Hydra Simulacrum can kill almost anything. Oh, come on, death. Ah, Staff of Air. De Staff of Death would be really nice for us right now. So now, as long as Kiku's corpses aren't, like, totally awful, um, like, like elves or something, we can, um, we can, we can simulacrum and win just about for anything. Okay, that's a good trove. That's something that's very easy to get. Uh, so we will eventually get Shadow Dragon Scales, and we will eventually be able to enchant it up. So I like that. Let's just duke it out with this guy, fine. The one downside side to Simulacrum, the one downside is that they don't last very long. But they don't need to, for what they are. I always find um, late dungeon to be really awkward, since Half the time it's just a cakewalk, um, but then very occasionally you'll run into something super dangerous. I find that, well, that's pretty common in just about every part of the dungeon, but um, it's like particularly bad in here. Okay, um, I've got a deep elf mage here. Uh, we found this thing immediately, which is cool, but um, we don't want to fight all this stuff at the same time. We do want to go in, we might find some... <laughs> really? Alright. Um... This is fine, we'll fight here. A troll corpse, okay good. I can just fight this stuff, but now I'm taking damage, so we'll just, uh... Let's just let our little buddies handle it for us. Alright. Unfortunately, they're not doing very good work. Um, okay, that's cool. Ooh, smite. Alright, I have Animate Dead now. That's even better. Going in here was maybe not the best idea. Um, get the explosion. Which may draw quite a few things to this location, but... Let's just Ambrosia real quick. Fine. I really would like to identify this wand of digging. That's okay. We have another wand of digging anyway. another source of MR plus if we really want it. Let's rest. Now, it's not the end of the world if I don't make it to this thing, but... To the portal, I mean. Oh, I should have been death channeling. That's one issue that I find to be common with necromancers, is you have 
such an abundance of stuff you can do. We are slowed right now. That's okay. Oh, it's snored. Um, let's just leave. No big deal. Things may have cleared out from, from this area by now. They may have not. They did not. Um, but that's okay because we can pull them piecemeal. Well, let's take a look at this dude. Worst case scenario, 75 damage. That's not enough to kill me. I think we can melee him if we just... Yeah, see the spines do most of the work. We should probably have RC Plus on for this. I'm gonna go in. Okay, I see it's actual demons, so let's pop on our cold. It could have been, you know, animals. It's gonna be some statues. We can whack them, probably. Wow, is this thing really gonna make me use a scroll of blinking? That could have been annoying. Let's walk out. As soon as it becomes not advantageous, we just walk away. Not bad, right? This is the one place where the scarf of cloud immunity comes in real useful. Okay, this is annoying. Um, Just because this thing is resistant to cold doesn't mean it won't die to my simulacrums. I do pretty good damage, so let's just let our guys handle it. Make some zombies as well. Corpse call or receive corpses is really good in here. You get rhyme drakes, you get yaks, which are pretty decent, you get bears. I'd like to be able to kill these dudes on my own without doing it, but it's unlikely. Did we get some luck? Yes, we did. <sighs> Quick way to freezing. Can't see us going in that direction, but maybe, I guess. I'll grab it just in case. Yeah, maybe the uh, Ice Demons one-on-one, -on -one, I can take them pretty reasonably. I was thinking I couldn't. But this armor helps a lot. And the fact that we have RC+. Plus. And the Spines. I would like to see what my second level of the fire resistance is going to be. Second and third. Well, no, the second one's going to be fire cloud immunity, I think. The third is either going to be hellfire or fiery blood, but if it's fiery blood, I really want to rush to it. If it's hellfire, unfortunately, I don't think it'll show up until, like, level 27 or something ludicrous like that. Oh my god, these clouds. Uh, I need to teleport. Whoops, I did not mean to magic map at all. I need to add don't read to that. Teleport. One, two. Fine. It's the clouds that forced me to do that because I walked into there in a dangerous situation. Oh, 
I was like, I walked in and I was already hurt, is what I'm saying. Cool. Clear out a few more of these, and we should be able to find the end. I don't think that there will be... Well, actually, no. Yeah, no, I don't think there will be ice manuals in here. I was hoping for it. But probably no such luck. An artifact. A good artifact. Decent, anyway. How much is this armor messing with my casting? A whole ton. Wow, if I take that off, then I can cast my good spells already. I'm just going to have to be a lot more careful. I can check a few more robes as well for Arc Magi. <laughs> hey, look, it's a, it's a dead... It's a dead reaper that died to these clouds. He's dead almost every time I walk in here. But yeah, I think we're going to be on the road plan. We're just going to have to melee a little less. So the thing is, we can kill anything. I'd rather have magic resistance on the resistance. We will even try on this chainmail um, and this rope. See, the thing is, I have minus ER, but it's only level 1. So, like... In theory, it would be nice to wear a chain mail, but in practice, it really does wreck um, our casting. I mean, it's really only a little bit less encumbering than a plate mail, so. Um, on the plus side, if I wear pro magic, this dude can't get me. And check it out, this guy would have caused us trouble before. Um, do I want to haunt? Yeah, I'll risk going to the abyss. It's fine. Couple castings. And haunt, haunt kills him. Haunt kills everything. Okay. Still training spell castings because I want to get cause fear. It's very important to me. A little late in the game, but it's going to be useful, I promise. take a lot more damage now that we're just in a robe. didn't want to, Snorg didn't want to come play. Or I mean the, the actor didn't want to. Snorg was coming, but he wasn't. Whoa, whoa, I don't want to swing on this guy. What am I doing? Up here, drain. Wow, he can technically kill me. That's really bad. Um, I'll take a step. Another step. There we go. It's 
See, I'm trying not to overuse. Um, Try not to overuse haunt because, well. First of all, it steals half my experience if it does all the work. Secondly, um, more importantly, it can miscast and send me to the abyss. Oh look, a wizard. Shifter corpse, fine. I'll take that simulacrum, I guess. Not the best simulacrum I've seen in my life. to this wizard, um, but he doesn't have LCS, so it's fine. Only one more spell level needed for cause fear. Remember, spell casting is making us a little better at casting what we're what we're uh, already training, so or what we're already casting, haunt and things like that. Probably not as quickly as it would be if we only had a little bit, but. Like the first five. Um, ranks or so of it are going to be necessarily better. Okay, let's have some fun. We're going to have... Oh, oh, disappointing. I thought it would be Snorg Troll Simulacrum. You know, like when you animate things. Like, there's Snorg the Troll Skeleton. Okay, I'll let the Simulacrums kill the Cyclops since it's particularly dangerous. Got a ghost here. Um, I am... Let me put it this way. I, I ain't afraid of no ghost. Um, I can dispel this guy and kill him very easily. With that said, I'd rather do it on a staircase. things up one by one. I really want... <sighs> yeah, this isn't safe. Let's... I really wanted to lure the um, centaur. Stinner does 3d12, that's 36. That's less hit points. That's more hit points than we have. Or less hit points than we have, I mean to say. Okay, now we're in the danger zone, so I gotta quaff healing. Okay. Should have haunted him to begin with. Gargoyles, I improperly assess that as not a threat, but they still are, especially if I'm in. The problem is I swapped to this robe, so things have gotten a little bit awkward for a while. I'm trying to play this character as like melee and it's just not quite working. We've got barbs. Um Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna walk backwards anyway. Um, just 
to get closer to the staircase, even though Hot will probably deal with this for us. Okay. Okay, we're good. Sorry about all the flashes. Whoa, I'm... What am I doing? I'm... That's why it's flashing. I'm being hit by something. Derp. I thought that was because my stuff was finding off screen. And it was saying like something hits, but probably a little bit of both. Okay, another ring of wizardry. We could pop that on if we felt like it instead of the pro magic. Uh, I do not. I do not want to do that. He can do 66 damage. Not a big deal. Oh, it's Francis. Uh, let's not fight Francis with this kind of bad engage. He's got guys and we just have a zombie. Not so good. So he's got iron shot. Let's see just how much that can do. 75 damage. It's pretty rough. However, oh, pff, there's a ghost next to me. Derp. Let's kill him with the spell undead. Very easy. Down he goes. All right, so cause fear. Now memorized. Really good spell. You should take it too. We're going to train hexes and summonings. And we're going to have haunt online and actually usable in short order. And we might as well train a little necromancy as well. Because we really, what we really want is the haunt infestation combo. Which, unfortunately, robs you of a bit of experience. Uh, but, saves the day. Now, of course, we'd like to be doing all this in that chain mail. But, like I said, we're just, we're just going to need to wait until we have the um <clears throat> until we have like three ranks of the er mutation that'll be super good um and maybe a couple other things like like some armor training even okay francis didn't see us that's cool Book of Power, um, if I decided to go in the Conjuration's direction, which I still could, uh, that would be handy. You know what? I don't want to leave. I don't want to leave Francis lurking around over here. We're going to explore and take him out with Haunt. He's been triple haunted. Quadruple haunted. That should be enough. Yep. Down he goes. Haunt's good enough, right? Well, I think Kiku gets mad if you use Holy Word. That's interesting. <laughs> okay, um, this is, this is cute, this is actually really, really bad, um, oh man, he can do 140 damage, that's so bad. Obnoxious. Blinking won't really help us because then both of them will be next to me and I'll just have taken damage from the ugly thing as well. 
See, this is why I hate wearing robes, because in my armor, this would be, like, not a huge deal. I'd just go upstairs, but... Net is an option, but then it's not guaranteed to work, and I don't even know if it works on Hydras. I'd have to check the size. Um, nothing is guaranteed to get me out of this. Top tier, bad situation. I'm gonna fear. Okay, good, they're both frightened. Let's just get out of here. That's, that's dumb. Um, going downstairs and being next to a Hydra is dumb. Knowing that that kind of thing exists sort of makes me want to never play a pure caster again. Um, because being in a robe at 100 hit points is just... You know, if you're forced to stair dance, then you might just end up next to a Hydra. Oh, it's Rupert. He can't paralyze us. Oh, well, that floating eye can, I'll tell you that. What's the speed of a floating eye? Only speed 10, cool. We're going to use Haunt on the floating eye. If we get paralyzed, it's no big deal. We've got tons of dudes. Nice. Rupert dies to Haunt. Sublimation of blood would be good on this character. I should probably get it. Okay, um, let's go up. Can't imagine that Hydra's gone anywhere. I'd rather dupe it out with these guys. Fine. This, um, this full floor wide vault is kind of dumb because it's got, it's got floating eyes all over the place and they can kind of teleport out of this, uh, I want to say this is the one where there's like a, this whole area is just a place where floating eyes and a bunch of other crap are and they'll walk into a teleporter and could end up next to you. But with the sputter casting, it's not a huge deal. I mean, you get you get a warning, like like so. Let's go up. Etten's probably gone. Not quite, but you miscast cause fear. I miscast cause fear, and I miscast the. Uh, the haunt. That's not cool. Let's wear our whip of fire resistance, putting it at RF plus plus. It's fine. We'll let haunt deal with this. Uh, we got Azrael. I'm gonna yell for the Eden. I just know he's waiting. Maybe not. Oh, there he is. Oh, man. Mm, I'm not going to risk it. Even if we had the haunts up. Right, actually, these guys are probably gone by now because there is an open door. Again, I'm paralyzed. Oh god, this is terrible. Am I dead? I'm not dead. Well, let's go up. That could have been really bad. It's sort of cavalierly fighting things that can paralyze me. It's not so good. So you can see now why I hate this floor. Um, it's just a really, really, really nasty kind of vault.
then again, this is D15, so a little bit of challenge is not unwarranted. Should have popped on our cold as soon as I saw this guy. Okay. everywhere I see. Let's see if we can get the haunt on on Azrael, which we do. Now he can hellfire me, but we should be fine. He's rather busy and he's slow. Nice, he's dead. Oh boy. This, uh, this, this character does a good job of pulling the whole floor to him somehow. Um, hard to say exactly why. I think it's just virtue of this floor, really. Cyclops coming. Okay, fear is finally doing things. Right, I should go up. Finally, we're going to take out this Hydra, probably. It's okay if I get paralyzed. I have too much stuff in the way. Well, no, I should go up. The Hydra died anyway, so there we go. This is the most stair dancey level I've done in quite some time. Wow. If I die to this, this is going to be really lame because he only had one turn to get me paralyzed. I'm going to die. Oh my god, I almost died. That's ludicrous. Um, hey, floating eyes. He shrug off the repeated paralysis. Like, look at that. He, going upstairs, he could have paralyzed me again, and it only didn't work because... <laughs> yeah, paralysis is a really dumb mechanic. Um, honestly, if I were... The, probably the totally optimal thing to do would be to stop being on this floor... We're just not strong enough to do it safely yet, but I've already done most of it. So it almost feels like, why not finish it, you know? But god, paralysis is just, it's just brutal. Um, I, I almost want to say that I feel like the, the mechanic is literally bugged on floating eyes because... Like, it's supposed to be, they come into your line of sight, and then it's like they start looking at you, and then it takes a couple turns, right? But the reality of it that I've experienced, um, the reality of it that I've experienced is more, oh god, we gotta go up. And I'm paralyzed immediately. Oh, do I die? I die. Alright, that's it. 
That's the streak. Yep, I knew I should have not stayed on this floor. Okay. There you go. There's there's my friend. Um, so lesson learned. If you go to go upstairs, you can't. Um, you're not necessarily going to have enough time before he does that. Now, that I actually knew. Um, but what I didn't know, and what I think might be glitched, is like the part where, well, earlier... He walked up and then immediately uh, had time to paralyze me within like one turn. Um, and it didn't even say if his eye was fixing on me. So that I'm a little confused about. I think that the timer maybe keeps going. Uh, who knows? But anyway, we'll probably restart, uh, restart the streak soon um, with a little more caution towards these guys. Um, but until then, I am signing out.